I'm going to show you how to create waves with the GHD Platinum Plus flat iron. In this video, I'm using the GHD Platinum Plus flat iron because it is perfectly designed and shaped to create effortless waves and curls. Of course, you can use any flat iron, but some might be more difficult than others. Of course, before we begin, I'm going to be using my heat protectant. This is my beloved Tresemme heat protectant. It is so far the best one I have used. I'm also going to be using my dry bar detangling brush. This is a really good brush to use when you are straightening or curling the hair. Okay, let's get started. I'm first going to start with the frame of my head. And this is going to be a little bit difficult to describe, so definitely try to watch and mimic what I'm doing. So basically, I'm going to start from the roots, and I do this when I am doing the frame of my hair. I'll start with the very top. And basically, I'm just twisting my hand inward and dragging it down. And this is the curl or wave that you will get. Of course, you can tighten it to make it more of a curl, and then you can make it even looser to make it look more like a wave. Okay, let's start with another section. So you could see I am lip turning my hand inward and dragging it down, and I'm literally doing this at exactly the same time. I'm turning my hand in and then dragging it down. Okay, now starting with the bang area, it's literally the same thing, but you want to make sure you're a little bit more loose um, around the bang area because you don't want it to be too curled. And voila! Okay, now let's just quickly speed up the other side of my hair. Okay, now let's start with the bottom portion of my hair. Again, I do the same thing here, except I start a little bit lower when I create the wave, um, when I do the rest of my hair. So as you can see, I'm going about halfway, if not lower, flicking the wrist in and then bringing it down. One tip I learned is that you want to alternate between which way you turn your wrist. So with this one, I'm going to turn it inward as opposed to outward. Okay, so this is the finished result with the bottom part of my hair. As you can see, it's a little bit stuck together, but towards the end, you can go ahead and fluff it out. You can also use a brush to make the curls a little less tight. Okay, now we have fast forwarded to the crown of my head, and the way you section your pieces up here is totally how you prefer. Um, if you do it forward like this, you get a little bit more volume. I also just use the dry bar because it helps to smoothen out the hair a little bit before I straighten. And again, here you can do the roots or you can um, do it like halfway. Okay. Another important thing is you want to make sure the hair is at least in the middle or the top because you want to make sure that you're not missing any strands. I know that sounds confusing, but basically you want to make sure that every strand of hair is inside the curling wand because if you don't manage it as you're going down your hair, your hair can actually like come out of the flat iron and that part won't be straightened. So oftentimes like the end piece of your hair won't get curled because it slips out of the, the flat iron. <laughs> it's kind of something you will understand if you're actually in the process of doing it. All right, so this is the final look. I'm just going ahead and fluffing everything out. I would use a brush, but I'm kind of content with how it looks right now. And that's it. That's how you get effortless waves with the GHD Platinum Plus Flat Iron. You can also achieve curls, 
um, or just get loose waves like this. I love the GHD Platinum Plus so much because it makes it so effortless and so easy to get these nice waves. They last for an entire day. However, if you apply some hairspray, it will help to um, make them last a little bit longer. I also recently heard that some dry shampoos can help make the waves and curls last a little bit longer. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to give it a thumbs up and share it with others who would benefit from watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope to see you in another video. Bye.